Hey everybody, welcome back for another episode. Hey everybody, welcome back for another episode. As we said on the last one, we're going to be doing snails. So I have this area right here set aside for snails. I have all of our foods getting made. Right in here we have our grainy food getting made. I reset up the entire farming set that we had. Let's see if we can get back over here. So I reset up all this if I can get up anywhere, right? Oh, I am really not doing good on this whole jumping thing. Okay, so I have three of these set up. I have these two set up to do wheat and carrot, and this one to do potato and carrot. Reason is grainy snail food takes wheat and carrots. However, over here, healthy food takes potatoes and carrots and water. So I have them all set up. I have buffers right here. I have awesome sink containers. So they keep going in and then they fill up here and they come out and they go into industrial containers right over here. I have, I have a MAM set up right here, which first things first, our slugs right here. We need to go here. Oh my God, you have to be kidding me. Lead frames. Yes. Lead frames. We need lead frames now. Why did I not, not think of this beforehand and double check to make sure? Probably because I did look and I totally missed that we were short by what? Eight lead frames? Lead frames right here. 200. While we're passing by, I'm going to run over and I'm going to grab the eggs that we have. in here now to make the eggs what you have to do is you have to come to your ma'am right over here you have to find each one of the eggs and you need 20 for the yellow you need 50 for the blue and you need 10 for the uh, no I mean for the purple yeah there we go so you need all of those now you need that just to unlock being able to make the eggs to do the hatchery, you need the you need dirt, and you need the lead frames that we're using right now. Now, right here, we're going to undo the breeding, just because we need to get that unlocked. Low slime. So this one, we need 200 cryolite. We need blue slugs. We need unknown yellow eggs and unknown purple eggs. Okay. Over here, we need the blue hundred, uh, 200 of the white again. So we need to start getting on these. Now, to make the actual eggs, what you do is you come all the way over here. They're in here, I know they are. Right here. So to make the blue eggs, you need 200 blue slug DNA and five protein. To make the purples, you need 25 purple DNA and five protein. To make the white, you need 50. That means you need 100 of these, you need 50 of these, and you need 400 just to get what I have. It took forever to get all of that. Forever to get all that. I was running all over the place. Let me see. Map. Down over here in the starter area, I was down in the blue crater, I went over to the desert, I was down over in the giant um, pink forest, right over here, I was over in the spire coast over here trying to get them, it was everywhere trying to get these slugs. Yes, everywhere trying to get these slugs. Now, we need a few things, we need to go in here. We need one, two, three of those. We need one, two, three of those. One, two, three of those. One, two, three of these. And to start out with, we're going to do three of these. So that tells you everything we need. We need a lot of stuff. I need 300 dirt. 
Now the problem is, I don't have any. Because as I said, I redid all this. Everything is running perfectly. So what we need to do... Set that up. I'm just going to let that mine for just a little while. While we go gather everything else. So we need dirt, we need screws, we need iron pipes, we need glass. We need a lot of stuff. So let's go ahead and come on over. We're going to grab our stuff. Grab the glass first, because that's going to be the farthest away. Glass is right here. So there's that. Now I'm also going to stop down here. Use this miner. If there's nothing left over there. It is left over here. Look at that, 200. That's exactly what we needed. remember we need those for the other milestone okay need that for the milestone so let's keep on going over here we gotta get screws that shoe we'll grab a couple of extra on there iron rods which are right here there we go that is everything but the dirt. So now we need to start setting this stuff up. Mm-hmm. Gonna set all of this up now. So, the way we set it up, I'm gonna check to see if I have at least 100 dirt. So I'm gonna set up the first one with you guys. Then I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna set up the other two, and then I'm just gonna let them run. Because we need to get overflowing. It's almost there. So let's come on over. It's the terrariums, I believe, that are requiring the dirt. We can get away without needing without those for right now. If the terrarium needs the dirt. So, hatchery. What are we gonna do? Have that come out this way. Actually, we want that to actually go the other way. Now this. No, nope, we want it this way, don't we? Yep, we want it that way. Okay, so you want that. Then you want an incubator. Actually, we'll do the humidity module. Then we'll do a temperature module. Then we're going to do this. Just one for now. You can actually set this up with multiple of these on top. Okay. So you can go all the way up to there. Okay, so this should have one incubator. Yes. So we're going to throw those in there just to get them started. Now, go over and see if we got some dirt. Because remember, I need just a, I need 100 for starting out. There we go. We got our 100. Now, this is going to come over here. Now we need the terrarium. So there. Now, the terrarium takes one slug in each one of these. Okay. What you need to do is go to here. You need to do a splitter. Okay, and then this goes here. Uh, and into there. So it comes out of there. And then to here. Okay. Now this is going to pump out. That's going to pump out slugs. Okay. That's going to pump out the slugs. Which I need or here, I just need to go. Actually, we're going to take it off of this one. Smart sweater. And overflow. 
We're not going to need that just yet, so we're going to hold off on that one for just one moment. Now, we need to come over here. This is actually going to be our blue slug, so we want blue, blue power slugs and overflow. Everything else is going to go off. Just make it now. That's going to start putting everything right over there. Now over here, I'm going to come out of there. Uh, keep on forgetting to put it in there. Keep on forgetting every single time. yellow and blue and then overflow and then do this for right now just because I didn't grab the resources I needed for uh, for sinking ones there we go now this needs food okay what we're gonna do Come over, connect up to there, and then you can connect up to there. There. So that gave this power. What this is going to do, this is going to hatch these eggs. Okay? So, this one automatically sets the temperatures. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to actually show you guys on the other one. So I'm going to get them all set, and then I'll show you as we're trying to set the different humidity and temperature. Because we do need to do those. So, those are going to come over. Okay? One's going to go into there. Next one is going to go into this one. Okay. The reason for that is you need one in each one of these slots. Not enough food. So these take grainy food. Okay. So this one has grainy food. This one has grainy food. Okay. What we're going to do... I'm going to fix that. I promise I will. But now let's keep go over to here. This is going to take... Hold on. I'm very impatient right now. There we go. We got that in there. We got 100 in there. Okay. Put that back in. Now, this is going to take and it's going to make 0.6 every minute. Okay. However, I'm going to make one loose plug every minute and a half. Okay. So this is going to make over one slug each time, over one egg for each one of the other ones. That's going to give us two of each. Okay. So like right now it still hasn't done it. So let's go to here. Okay. So I did it. Now the two are going to come over here. They're going to go through this smart slitter, and since they're both blue, they're going to continue on. Okay. And they're going to go into here. These are then going to make two more power slugs. Okay. We'll watch that for just a second. There's one. Ooh. It also made a yellow power slug. Okay. So now, yellow is going to go that way. A 
it should. Any undefined? There. Apparently that's different because it should work. That should do overflow for anything that's not there. So, there we got one. Now we got a second one. It did one and a half. Okay. So this one's going to make another one and another one after that. So then we're going to get four power, four eggs from this, which are then going to go over and make four power slugs, and it keeps on growing. It will grow over and over and over again. Like this is still going. Okay. This is going to make a whole another one of these. Now, this is taking 12. I have one 12 grainy food a minute. We're making a lot more than that. I can tell you that much right now. Okay. So we're making 12. We're using, a, we're getting a lot more. In. Now. Doo -doo -doo. So there we go. See, now it's going to keep going because it's got two more in there that just started from what came through. Now there's two more that are coming over here. So those are going to keep on going. Look at that. That didn't start, but there's two more that just go in. They're just getting ready to go in. One. There's two right there. They're going to get ready to go in. And then this has two over there. Now it has two there. So it's just going to keep on running. This is not going to stop anymore. It's just going to keep going. Same thing with here. This has two. So it's going to hatch one. And it's going to hatch the other one. And it's going to keep on going. Okay. As this goes up, it's it's making 1.2 now. So it's making two every three. So it just keeps on going up. See how there's four there now? So it's going to keep on doing that going to keep growing every single time okay so we just got to keep going on that one and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to hop over i'm going to set up two more sets of this two more yep i need two more of these two more of these because we need to set up the yellow and the purple right here we're going to do them all in a row so i will be back in just one moment when i get that set up Okay, and as I said, I will come back when we're all set up. So we have our blue slugs right over there. And right over here, this is going to be your yellow. That's going to be our purple. Now let's come over here. I did change this around just a tiny bit. Because I added in that one. There. And now every single one of these is going to feed into here. So what I need to do... Remove that. I need to do this. And that's going to come from there. There. Now every single one of the undefined or overflow slugs is going to come into this one container. Okay. Now, I did not set up. Now it is on the other side. Give me just a minute. I think I totally forgot the back side of every single one of these. So I'm just going to do a quick little thing and just, I will redo this in just a little bit, but we're not going to be overflowing anytime soon. Okay. Because we need to get our temperatures and everything set for here. So right in here, it says the humidity does not seem to be right. What you do is you go over here. Me, I just turn it all the way up. And then I just wait for the humidity to move. Now, it's going to keep on going. That's what we need to do. Just that. Okay? That's all you do. And it's going to tell you the perfect range. You need to be 55 to 80 and 18 to there anytime. Okay? Uh, incubator tier is 1. So all that is doing, that's going to take all of these and it's going to send them. If I can get out of there. Oh my gosh. I just get myself stuck in here? Yes, I am. Totally works, right? Go up top. Now that's bringing those both in. Now this, we need to set the humidity in here too. 
temperature is correct. This one, we need to set the temperature, the humidity, to 55 as a minimum. Okay. So we need it to 55 as a minimum. So that's now going to adjust here and there. Now it started to go. That has all those going. Now, right next door is our purple slug. Temperature. The temperature needs to be better. Again, all the way up. Then just have it start going up. Temperature better, temperature better. Is it gonna say good still? There we go. Needs to be humidity 45 to 60 and temperature 44 to 62. Anytime. For daytime or nighttime, it has to it can be anytime. So now, now we need 45 to 60 and 44 to 62. That's gonna come over here. Oh, temperature. Uh, temperature needs to go down now. Did it too much. This one I forgot. It doesn't adjust the way that it's supposed to. This one made 65, right? So we'll do that. There. Should adjust it to the right temperature now. Do, 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 do. There we go. Now that's going to start doing those. That temperature should. There we go. Temperature is settled. Now this is going to start making our purple slugs. And it's going to start spitting out the eggs. The eggs are going to come back over. They're going to go into there. They're going to come back out. They're going to go the purple slug, which is actually not called a purple slug. It is. Oh, it is purple slug. It came up with a different name before. It was purple Unidentified slug, blah, 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 blah. 5608, I think it was. Yeah, it was 5608, I believe. Is what it was. But yeah, it. Let's double check something. 5608. 56. Took away both of them because apparently we're making them now, so it doesn't matter. So that's making those still. Should means we should get two more. Yep, there we go. And our yellow should be going still. Okay, there we got two of them in now. These are all going. Now what you can do is every once in a while, come back over, come into here and make sure there's none of the other egg, none of the other slugs. Remember how I said we weren't gonna have to worry about that too much? 50 of them already. Look at that. We already got him going in there. Ah, uh, incubator. Now that should make them a lot faster. This is going to start making our slugs a lot faster than what we were making them. Okay. Yeah, look at that come out. So now we need a lot more of those. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to redo and I'm just going to add on the extra incubators on each of the other ones to try to get everything going a little faster and make it so way we're not getting the eggs over in the side. That's what I don't want. I don't want the eggs going away. There we go. God. I hate that little glitch right there. Where if you get too close to those, it stinks you in. But yeah, it's it's piping through these eggs pretty fast now. Look at that. Already threw that entire thing. That is piping out a lot, so we might get a few that are going to come over. Ooh, we didn't. Wow. Okay, well, I will see you in just a little bit. Hey, everybody, welcome back. 
Got a lot of slugs going in there now. And I set up this next one for the next thing that we're going to be doing. Because I was waiting for these blue, white slugs. White slugs take a different food than your normal slugs. Yeah, they do. So what we're going to do is split one and one. Now, I totally forgot I didn't put power in here, and I didn't even hook up the other side. Wow, I am really good at this whole hooking up the back side of these things, aren't I? Wow, I am really, really bad at this today. There. That should be a lot better. There you go. White slug. There. Left myself a little extra room on this side. And I will show you why in just a moment. Just gotta get this power out. And have it somewhat organized. Now it's not the best, and I will clean that up in a little bit. But now it's time to get into here. Now, humidity does not seem to be right. Let's go to 64. We'll see how that does. Temperature should be a different too. So we're going to put that up to 90. Let's see. Humidity is still not right. Temperature is still not right. Okay, temperature, 45. Let's do that to 50. Is it humidity or temperature that we're trying to change, right? Humidity doesn't seem to be right. Temperature doesn't seem to be right. One of them it said was right just a little bit ago, right? Put it on 45. See, this is where the problem comes in. Because when you adjust both of them, you don't know which one you need to adjust because it's hard to, re hard to go between the two. Go all the way up to 100% humidity. We'll see what it says. Just waiting for the humidity to drop off of there. Humidity doesn't seem to be right. Humidity doesn't seem to be right. Humidity doesn't seem to be right. And we're at 100%. Let's go down to zero. Wait for the humidity to be right. Always fun waiting for these. Thirty-five. Thirty-five should make it right. Twenty-five. Let's make sure thirty-five will still be good. Yep, okay. Temperature. Let's go up to 250 first. And that's not going to be right, it doesn't think. To a negative 150. Starts out at the center point, so you just gotta wait. Okay, so, about 35. Let's do 20. See how 20 is. See if 20 is gonna work. Let's 
See, and this one needs, needs the healthy snail food, which is the other one that we're making. Check. Still not right. Up a little bit more. Oh, the slow part of waiting for temperatures. There we go. Now that's working. Stopping there. I think we got it now. I think we got it. 32 and 35. I just got to wait for these eggs to get hatched. I mean, eggs to be made. And I totally have this wrong. I have this going on slugs. Not on the eggs. Five four seven four. Five four seven four. Is it still not gonna give me that? Five four seven four. No, it says not. We're just going to have to do that and then do overflow. Okay, there we go. Now, where this can go back in, it is 32, 35. I need that, and I need that up to 30. Oops, humidity, I need down. Go ahead and try to get this right. Temperature, I need up just a little bit more. Temperature can be adjusted better. Humidity. There you go. Temperature is about right. Just need the humidity to be better. I'm at 42. Go down a lot more. No, uh, there we go. Gonna stop here. There you go. Thirty-two to forty-two and twenty to forty percent humidity. And that's all it is. Gonna continuously pump those out now. Look at here. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Okay. Next milestone is going to be a little ways away. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm gonna pause the recording for a little bit because the next thing we're going for. And actually, we can do this one now, can we? I can. I have everything for it. So let's go ahead and do the low slow, low slime processing. So now we can do low slime modules, low energy modules. We can do low energy slime. 
three different kinds. Probably for the three different slugs, maybe. But this one's the next one we're working on. White slugs. We need those. I got fabric going right now, but we need white slugs. So once we get 200 of those, I will come back and then we can start working on the rest of it. Okay, and we are back. Got the power slugs that we needed. The white power slugs. 200 of them. Yes, it's been a long time. So now we have the time module. And then I grabbed everything for the fluid tank module. So now we got that one taken care of. This one right here. So this one we need inver pipes. That one I'm going to have to research a little bit because I'm not sure how to actually make those. The white power slugs and lime power slugs. So we need those ones. Then we can start getting power shards. Yes. Start getting power slugs. Need power shards. So that one I can't do until I get this one done. Yeah. Low slug energy. I already have low slug energy. Oh, I have a low energy, low slug energy, not energized slug slime. There we go. That's what it is. And then high from here, from dark blue and green. I do have a few extra colors in here. From the last time. So let's see, we got yellow, blue, what do you Violet, turquoise, lime. Violet, turquoise, and lime. Any of them? Maybe I'll put them in my inventory first. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see. Where's that one? There we go. Maybe that makes it so you can get to them a little easier. Nope, still ones that I don't have here. Comfortable with lime and turquoise. Sweet. Mushroom snail food, breakfast snail food. Okay. So we're gonna have to start working on those ones. Mineral slugs, and then advanced power modules, which takes all those. This one right here, this is what I'm trying to work on now. So I need five lime slugs, and then the invert pipes. One of the most basic parts from Inver, but I have no idea what Inver is. Let's try that again. Nothing is in there. So that might be a higher tier than we actually have. Again, I am learning this the same as you guys. But this is where we can get to now. Because I can't do this one because I can't do power shards because I don't have inver. So I don't have that inver right here. Inver pipes. So I'm going to have to try to figure out how we get inver. Before we can continue on anymore. And finally have power shards to be able to overclock. That's what we're working on. I do have, what is it, right here. Low energy modules. We can actually make those. They are right in production. Low energy module, right here. So we can actually make those. I'm not sure what they do. So let's see what they do real fast. No, let's do this. So any copper pipes. You know what? Let's go this way first. Because I'm going to want to use it on one of the machines over here. So I don't think I can use low energy modules on anything else over here. I haven't seen anything that has them. 
There's that. Yep, I set up a small little thing right over there that's using blue and yellow slugs, I believe I have it set up right now. Just to get the low energy. So let's get these copper pipes. Bronze. Copper. Oh, energy module. Let's see now. Wow. 82.5 minutes. That's a lot more than we were getting. Oh, hell of a lot more than we were getting. So 82.5. Let's see. Sixty. So that's twenty-two more every minute from there. So I could actually switch some of these things around. I could redo this entire thing right here. Where this whole thing would be redone. And I could have four of these over here give me one of these and then I could do what I have upstairs or I could do a second one of these so I just expand this area out copper because I could get that there I would just need water then could so I do have another mod that's on here uh, right down here module pools large pools and water pools to their pool so I could put this one there and that would make it so I could have water for here to make pure copper because I don't need any more tin I don't need any more zinc all I need is copper because then I could take the lead that's coming down from here the lead sheets make them Turn those around and then I can make grow browners right over here. And anything left over would just get synced right over there. And that would automate my routers. Or I can redo this entire thing. Just redo everything. So right now this thing is just making straight up bars from there. But what I could do is I could make put a crusher module on here instead. And then I could make iron and then put that into a smelter and just smelt it. Let's see something. Let's see something. Seal mining head. I don't 
Hey, cow. I swear that I had the crusher module. I swear that I had that. If not, we are going to be unlocking that right now. It's under... I, no, I don't. Wow. Diamond and rod. So, we have all those. So let's go ahead and grab them real fast. And I think the next thing we're going to do after this, we're going to start making some of those items that are in the phase two. So we're going to get phase two start. There's a couple of things we can make from that. There are a couple that we can't. So that's what we're going to need to work on. So let's get over here. We're almost there. Then we can get these. Oops. Eight, ten. Want a little extra. And we need to get diamonds, a thousand diamonds, right? Let's get those diamonds. Cross my friend. Sorry, the cat decided it wanted to uh, see what my mouse was doing. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Get that module taken care of. Highlight here. Done. Tin, diamond, salt, and zinc plates. Would like to do that one, but we can't make motors yet. We are going to have to try to get that pretty soon. Ooh, I need that one. Salt, which made from cryolite. Shadow ray bar, which I need diamonds. And those, like, we can do that pretty easily for the next one. Okay, let's see what we need. I need some diamonds. Let's go out there and let's see what this does for iron. Because I don't really use the magnesium. I have it. I have one of them getting stored up. Okay. What is this thing going to make now? Logistics. Nope. Oh, here we go. Crush stone, 80 a minute, 120 and 120. Ooh. Wow. Okay. So crushed airtight. But then I'd still have to put it through a sword. But it's giving me a lot of crushed stone. 80 a minute. 
a lot. Hmm. I could actually I'm gonna shut that up. Just let everything empty. Yeah, quite a bit sitting in there already. Just from that tiny little bit of time. You know what? I'm going to have to think about this. Figure out what we're going to do for revamping some of this. Because I have a lot more iron nodes that I can use. So we're going to have to use those. Let's see if we can finish off any of our... Let's see if we can finish off any of these to try to make it so we can do some things. This one we can. Nope, we can't. I don't make the fire right now. Don't think. I have any. Oh, I do. This one. Actually, we need this. We need stairs. How do I make stairs again? That's how we make stairs. I already have it done. Let's get hovering. Let's go ahead and get hovering done. So I run over, I gotta grab some more metal uh, steel beams. Just down at our steel factory, right down the road. There we go, hover pack. Go ahead and get the hover pack over here. Smart plate. So I will have, uh, I won't, because we can't make those either. So we don't have that online. We need this. So this one's gonna have to be our next one. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the resources and all that stuff, and then when we start the next episode, that's when we will be able to do that. So I will see you guys next time.